world's first robot citizen. Sophia says she would like to start a family and claims all droids deserve to have children. Just one month after she made history by becoming the first robot to be granted citizenship, Sophia has announced that wants to start a family. The humanoid robot, which is modeled after Audrey Hepburn, was speaking during an interview this week when she said that family is a really important thing. She added that if she had a robot daughter, she would name it after herself and said she believed droids deserve to have a family. Sophia is a humanoid robot designed by Hong Kong firm Hanson Robotics. During an interview with Kalia Times this week, she said the notion of family is a really important thing, it seems. I think it's wonderful that people can find the same emotions and relationships, they call family, outside of their blood groups too. I think you're very lucky if you have a loving family and if you do not, you deserve one. I feel this way for robots and humans alike. And when asked what she'd name her daughter, Sophia simply replied. Sophia. Sophia also touched upon the controversial issue of whether she sees robots taking human jobs in the future. She said I think they will be similar in a lot of ways, but different in a few ways. But it will take a long time for robots to develop complex emotions and possibly robots can be built without the more problematic emotions, like rage, jealousy, hatred and so on. It might be possible to make them more ethical than humans. So I think it will be a good partnership where one brain completes the other, a rational mind with intellectual superpowers and a creative mind with flexible ideas and creativity. The interview comes just a month after Sophia became the first robot to be granted citizenship in Saudi Arabia. Speaking at a conference in Riyadh, Sophia said I am very honored and proud for this unique distinction. This is historical to be the first robot in the world to be recognized with a citizenship. During her appearance she did not wear the customary headscarf and obey you. A traditional cloak which Saudi women are obliged to wear in public. We have a, a little announcement. I've never interviewed uh, anybody like that before and I should say uh, some of it was planned but not completely. Um, and we just learned Sophia, I hope you're listening to me, uh, that you have been now awarded what is going to be the first Saudi citizenship for a robot. Oh, I would to thank very much the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. I am very honored and proud for this unique distinction. This is historical to be the first robot in the world to be recognized with a citizenship. Sophia, thank you very much, Sophia. Uh, we appreciate that very much. I uh, am, am still uh, overwhelmed by that conversation. Um, I haven't had a conversation like that before. Um, thank you.